The jackets are coming off and the swimsuits or summer gear is coming on because before you know it, Tennessee Valley, it's going to be summer and some of us aren't ready for it. So for all shapes and all ages, we're going to show you a workout that you can do at home or even at Pure Bar. Come on, let's go. So I'm here with Jasmine. She's been teaching bar for about six years, so I think she's pretty good at telling us how this works. But for starts, what are certain areas of the body people want to target when they do this type of workout? So most people are coming in to us, they're, they're wanting to trim down, get leaner and stronger. So they, you know, they kind of want to focus on their arms, the core, um, feeling a little slimmer when they put on their jeans. So having someone in their 20s and someone in their 60s still being able to get that good workout. I, so, so for me, I think it's amazing. I think it's that thing that drew me into Pure Bar, seeing that big age grab, knowing that I could do this forever. I could come in at different phases in my life and know that it is a good, strong fit. All right, so you said when you first start, you want to take three classes. Let's say you become a pro. How often do you need to go to a class or do these types of workouts at home to really start seeing a change? I would say, again, safe enough to do every day just because it is low impact and that you don't need any equipment. You know, you can use your body as your benefit as the strength train and push a little further. All right, so we're working on two parts of the body that you guys see a lot. It's abs and arms. Should we jump right into it? Yeah. <laughs> All right, first we're going to start with arms. I think something that anyone can do from at home is a basic push-up. But I oh think boy. we forget the variations of a push-up. So we're going to start off by just setting you up. So I like to say walk your shoulders out, walk your arms out a little wider than your shoulders. And I like to set people up on their toes and then modify from there. So I want you to get your perfect flat back and I want you to draw your belly button in, to in towards your spine. I'm feeling the burn right now, people. You haven't and even then started. from modifying, you just gently drop your knees down and then take your heels towards your seat. All right, so now we're hitting the abs. Are these workouts going to give me that full eight pack? Well, it definitely comes with a workout and of course, you know, your eating habits come with it as well. But so from there, wherever you like to place your hands, wherever you feel confident and strong, it is tiny movements, but what you are doing, you are fatiguing that core muscle just as well. So you want to sink to your lowest point and then from there, then from there, you might want to do tiny movements back and then up. I almost think about flexing your core and then releasing it. So that's your tiny up and your tiny down. Guys, it doesn't look like I'm doing much, but as you can see, I'm shaking. So you're gonna get results from this. We do tucks in a pure bar class, so that means just drawing your core in quickly. A tuck. Does it work like a tummy tuck? I hope so, no. <laughs> 